Hey guys, Rob Murphy from Holistic Healing Choices here. Now today we're going to go through a bit of an EFT tapper overview for the negative emotions of guilt and shame. So guilt and shame are big because if you hold on to these negative emotions they will drag you down and drag you down a lot. These are the ones that really stop us from getting out there and experiencing anything good or feeling good about ourselves as well because Guilt, shame, we feel bad about who we are because of something that we may have done. Or that we're made to feel bad about something that we haven't done. Or something similar along those lines. Now they can really make us feel like we are bad people. Which, most of the time, isn't the case whatsoever. It's just that we've done something that we thought was right in that time and it may have had consequences against the other person. Now, there are times too where we have done those bad things, but the thing is, if we're feeling this guilt and this shame, it shows that we are somewhat remorseful for what we've done, the actions that we've taken there. So, give yourself a little bit of a pat on the back that you are actually feeling that way, that you are able to feel that remorse, because it shows that you're willing to learn and change from that situation, which is a big thing. But if that guilt and that shame holds there, then not so much will we not be able to grow, but we won't be able to let go of that. We won't be able to just learn from the situation and move on because we're always holding on to that, that memory of the situation or that memory of the, that feeling of being a bad person. So we're going to tap all of that away to free ourselves from that so we can live a better future. So, when we're ready, bringing our hand up and just tapping. Even though I feel this guilt and the shame, I deeply and completely love, honor and accept myself. Even though I still have this guilt and this shame, I deeply and completely love, honor and accept myself. Even with all of this guilt and all of this shame, I deeply and completely love, honor and accept myself. And I know that this guilt, this guilt is just here to teach me something. And I know that I'm aware of this lesson. If I'm feeling this guilt, it means I know that something wasn't quite right. Even though it felt right at the time that I was doing it. Or just that I wasn't aware of something else that was going on that's made me take on these feelings of guilt. But I release all of this guilt and all of this shame now. I am being easier on myself and knowing that what I did, I thought was right. I was only operating at the best of my knowledge at that time. But this guilt and this shame is here to teach me that that, that wasn't the correct way. But now I know what is. And I no longer allow other people to put guilt or shame onto me. From the things that they expected me to do that I might not have done. All the things that I have done that they didn't approve of. This has all been a learning experience for me. And now that I've learned from that experience, I can let go of these negative emotions of guilt and shame. I release that heaviness that this guilt and this shame has over me. I no longer allow myself to feel the guilt or shame for these past actions. 
because as I move on with these new learnings, I will not be in that position again. And for someone shaming me for being me, I just do not accept that. I do not accept the guilt that others try to put over me. The guilt and the shame from their expectations of me. I know that I am my own person and that I'm doing the best that I possibly can. And I'm doing the best that I possibly can with the resources that I have now. And because I know that when I know better, I will do better. This has all been about learning. Life is always about learning. And the more I learn, the better I can do. But I can't learn how to do better unless I'm put into these situations. So I give gratitude that I can learn from these situations. And that this situation allows me to be a better person. And even though I can feel that guilt, I no longer hold on to it. I can just let it go completely once I've learned that lesson. And I no longer need to feel ashamed for having to learn that lesson. In fact, I'm quite excited that I went through this. So that I can help others by not having to go down this path. I can stop others from having to feel this because of the lessons that I've learned from this. These learnings will help everybody. And I know that the more I learn, the more I can help people. It feels good to help people. And that's all this guilt and shame is here to teach me. And for anybody that I have hurt in feeling this guilt and this shame, or that's a direct result of me feeling this guilt and this shame, I forgive myself for hurting those people. Even if they don't forgive me, I can forgive myself because I know that I will never be doing that again. Because I never want to feel this guilt or this shame again. And I know that time heals all wounds. So it's only a matter of time until this is all healed anyway. So why would I want to hang around with these negative emotions that are getting in the way of my growth? Why would I want to carry the guilt, this shame, this heaviness from those old situations? Those old situations where I thought I was acting to the best of my ability. To where I was acting with the best of my ability. But there was just something I wasn't aware of, or I didn't know the correct way to handle that situation. Which has led to this guilt and shame that I no longer need. Because I love myself, and I love how much I'm learning from these situations. Just taking these lessons on board, 
and growing and becoming such a better person for it. So much better than I was yesterday. I love myself and I love who I'm becoming. And I know that these emotions are just a guide to help me along the way. And I can use them to speed up my growth. Speed up my growth so that I'm aware of what's happened and what may happen in the future. So that if I do feel these, I know that there's something to learn from this and I know it's an opportunity to grow once more. So I am grateful for feeling this guilt and this shame and allowing me to grow now. So I hope that has helped you overcome some of this guilt, shame or any that heaviness that you've been carrying around. Feel free to drop a comment below of something that you think I may have missed with this one. But as always, much love and light to you on your journey of healing from this. But anyway guys, that's it for this one. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video.